Good morning. Welcome to another edition of Lineage Logistics, a day in the life series. June being National Safety Month, we often take an opportunity to sit back and think about what are the tools that we have in place in order to keep our team members safe. And as I think about that, the one thing that comes to mind is our culture and our team members driving that culture. At Lineage, in any industry, you can have wonderful processes, procedures, programs in place, but if they're not being implemented and embraced by the warehouse, by the team members themselves, and we don't have the right culture, none of that stuff would be successful. So this morning I'd like to introduce you to Jenna Seri, one of our environmental health and safety managers who is helping our team members live that safety culture. Thanks for the introduction, Dominic. Hi, I'm Jenna Seri. I'm the EHNS manager for Merrill Loma. I also help support Rialto and Riverside. It's been my privilege to work for Lineage for a little over nine years now. I've, I've held various roles throughout the company, so very excited. There's definitely a lot of room and opportunity for growth here, and that's just one of the many things that makes Lineage an awesome place to work. Great. You ready to show them around? Yeah, let's go. All right. Buckle up. Hi, everyone. Uh, things that I do on the day-to-day, -day, I often get asked. Uh, my day-to-day -day honestly changes by the minute. It's really just comprised of making sure that our team members stay safe throughout the day, that our customers' products stay safe as well. I encompass both food safety and general safety for our facility. It's important because someone needs to kind of oversee it. However, it's everyone's responsibility, so we all look out for each other, and it's really just those coaching opportunities that we have to teach our team members how they can be safe every day, enjoying every task that's important. I love it because it is not the same every day. Everything's always changing and we have limit, unlimited growth opportunities here at Lineage. All right guys, we're here with Mark Tuttle, who's the general manager for Miraloma. Hi Mark. Hi Jenna. Uh, what things do we do or do you do in your role here uh, that impacts safety? Um, ideally, uh, what we do here is making sure everybody gets home safe every day. I think that's the key. Um, and that is a very huge responsibility and one of the most important ones we have at the facility. Um, so our goal is to make sure this happens without fail. What are some of the key things that you look for um, in the facility in order to keep our team safe? Well, in order to achieve this culture, we have to uh, ensure that we have the right leadership in place that are going to follow the policies and to really make sure it happens. We can talk about it all day long, but if it's not being done and, and adhered to um, and educating the team out there in the warehouse, it's not gonna happen. So we have to make sure we have the right leadership in place to make it happen. With folks like you. <laughs> Thanks, Mark. You're welcome. the roof. I'm here to introduce Kevin Lair. He's our facility maintenance manager. So thanks for taking the time to spend with us today, Kevin. What are some of the things that you do on a day-to-day -to, -day to help our team members stay safe? Well, we're currently we're ready to kick off a, a, a large solar project and you know it's Lineage's effort to to reduce our footprint, uh, our energy footprint. So um, one thing we're doing with the solar project is we are working with the contractors very closely. Uh, we want to make sure that the, the fall hazard assessments and the uh, the job safety analysis are completed um, and then make sure that not only do we obtain their contractor safety documentation uh, that we also interweave lineages programs to ensure that not only their employees are safe but uh, ours additionally we appreciate everything that you do here kevin keep my team up to safe on day to day well thank you appreciate it
All right, hi everyone. I'm here with CEO, award winner, and QA manager for Mira Loma, Carl Hodge. She's gonna go through our VBSOs. Welcome, my name is Carla once again, and we are here to talk about VBSOs, or behavioral-based safety observations, which is one of our uh, key indicators is to show how well our team members are performing as it relates to safety. Some of the uh, areas we look at is uh, traveling speeds, stopping at stop signs, uh, fork height, and making sure that their um, feet are properly um, located on the MHG. As the old saying goes, you can't manage uh, what you can't measure. So we measure this, we use the BBSOs to measure uh, the area of safety. All right, well, let's go do one. All right, guys, well, that's all for today. Thank you so much for joining me for the EHS Manager's Day in the Life series for Lineage. Hope to see you guys soon and stay safe. Bye.